For the advanced exercises from sitting position, we could either have the patient sitting on a stable surface or we could have them sitting on an inflated disc like on the right here or on a ball like on the left. And we could do different exercises. First, we could start with uh, asking the patient to hold the position with the trunk in upright posture. We could increase the challenge by reducing the base of support or removing the support of the upper extremities. So clasp both hands and raise them in front of you. Okay. Now we could do simple activities, for example, to discover the limit of stability by asking you to lean forward and discover your limit of stability or backward or to the right and left. Okay. Always have the therapist next to the patient, of course, when doing these exercises with the patient to uh, provide protection. Uh, next, we could do exercises with the uh, lower limb. So I want you to lift the right knee up, right leg, okay. Now lower it down, lift the other knee, okay. So we could do one limb at a time, or we could do them alternating one after the other. So right, left, as if you are marching in place. Okay, good. We could do exercises with the uh, pelvis. So could you do pelvic circles? So do a movement with your pelvis, a circular movement uh, clockwise. Okay, counterclockwise. Okay, let's do exercises with the upper limb. Okay, so for the upper limb, you could do a, a shoulder flexion extension, release the hands, unclasp them and do flexion extension. This is bilateral and this is an advanced version. You could start with unilateral first if you wish to make it easy. Okay, and lower it, then do the other limb and then do both. Now both. Okay, now we could do the upper and lower limb. So it's as if marching in place. Lift the right knee and left shoulder and switch. Okay, and do it as if marching, so one after the other. Okay, good job. Another alternative would be to uh, do the exercises with eyes closed. So let's start with holding the position with eyes closed. Okay. And after holding, for example, for 30 seconds, now we could do the exercise um, with the eyes closed and shift forward and backward. Or to the side. Always remember that the therapist has to be next to the patient when doing these exercises. Okay, there are many other exercises that we could do, and this was just an illustration of few exercises.